And then the last helicopter. Oh, friend. I apologize. But goodbye! <laughs> Tried to shoot at me still. <laughs> Hello everyone, I'm Kibitz, and welcome back to Ravenfield, where today we're actually going to be playing some tower defense by trying to invade a city by dropping in with some awesome helicopters. And if you're excited for that, remember to leave a like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Alright, so you might be thinking of tower defense in like the auto turret kind of way, but no, 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 no. The enemy team is literally trying to defend their towers, and we have to go in and capture them. So I have the Chinook helicopter mod, I have a Black Hawk mod as well, and oh man, oh man, it is going to be an aerial invasion the likes of which the enemies have never seen. So here we go, we're getting into their city here. I'm seeing their tower, where's everyone else dropping? I wanna join my team. Team? What are we doing? Oh, they already dropped! Whoops. Okay, looks like we're invading this tower ourselves. Or not. Nope, we're good. Everything's fine, guys. Don't need to worry. We need to now worry. Oh my goodness! Gracious! Goodbye, enemies. I was never here. <laughs> Perfect landing. Never had an issue at all. But yeah, these towers, they have interiors as well, so we can uh, sneaky snake our way in. Sorry, Hurts. Climb our way up the tower. And hopefully... You know, what am I doing? What am I doing? Hopefully you can just make it to the top, capture the base without any issue. Kib says as he is about to run into some issues. Let's get some extra health here. See what we can do. It looks like we have captured like a trillion bases already. A trillion, not even an understatement. And we're about to get another! We got him. Enemy boy got nothing. Thank goodness I had the uber health or else I would have been not good! Ooh, metal man! Wow! Oh, wait, there's even more. Dang it, I'm using a M1014 mod, which is pretty much a semi-auto shotgun. Which is very good in these kind of close quarter situations, until you're kind of swarmed like that. It's alright though, always another helicopter to get. Can we commandeer that? No, we cannot. We can get some more teammates though, and we can invade our own tower. So I got a small little posse of like three extra guys. We are the elite tactical unit. And we are going to take over everything. Before we do that, we gotta take it we gotta take out some enemy helicopters here. So hey buddy, what's going on, pal? You gonna try and shoot the bullets at me? Yeah, good luck with that. When you're on the ground! Okay, that didn't work. That didn't work. Didn't work! That's a tower. Damn it. No, actually, it's Ravenfield. And you know what we do in Ravenfield? The best shit. Woo! <laughs> I can't believe it worked! Bill, Bill, Bill! I'm the greatest! Woo! <laughs> Even got someone on the way down. Dude, that was amazing. Look at that. Because of my epic strategy, we won. Of course. Kips is the greatest. So admittedly, last time was a little easy to win, because I think having the 35 people dropping on each flag is a little broken. So instead, now all the helicopters are switched up for these smaller capacity Blackhawk ones, which still have a lot of people, but maybe it will be a little bit more balanced? Not sure. Let's find out. The window's so small. But the minigun is so strong! Oh, it's gonna be wild, man. Gotta wait for everyone to drop. We're gonna drop with them this time, not mess it up. When are we doing it, guys? We're doing it now! Wait, I pressed the wrong button! <gasps> I just escaped! Oh my gosh! No! What just happened there? Okay, age old lesson learned, of course. Kibbit should always be driving. And why are you falling out of the helicopter? Are you kidding me? Turn your parachute off! Oh my effing gosh! Why does this happen to me? And yet another age old lesson is learned. Always have Kibitz drive and don't trust all the AI. They are evil. I swear to goodness, if you guys don't stay in your seats this time, I'm gonna be very upset. 
So where do we capture here? Uh, I guess the field here? I see a tank. Tanks are nice. So, guys. Wait, what do I do? E? No. That one. Yeah, have fun. I am going to be going not here. You see, the pro strat with transport helicopters like this with the miniguns on the side is never to fly around and just, like, use it to drop off units. No, 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 no. That's the basic strategy. The real strat is you land it. Uh, scratch that, you crash it down where you want to be, so you're forced to do battle to the death and not have the option to flee. Yeah, the ultimate pro strat. And I guess that gives me a good opportunity to test this bad boy out. It's a Mac 10. I think that's what it's called. Oh no, it's the SMG 11 pinky version. Which looks absolutely amazing, and I'm sure is pretty amazing. Like, if it looks this cool, you know it's gonna- Oh my god. You know it's gonna be really good. Someone put the time and the effort to make it look amazing. So you know they're putting the time in to make it, like, the best thing ever. And it is an absolute freaking laser. Holy snap. This is pretty rad, actually. Oh, it is actually just melting people. This is the coolest thing. And you get the satisfaction of taking people out with a pink gun. Oh, sorry teammate. Not, that wasn't me. <laughs> oh, that is freaking cool, man. I don't know though. Both these weapons I'm using are awesome. Both this and the shotgun. I like the shotgun a little bit more though. But then again, I'm biased towards that because M1014 is like, A, my favorite shotgun ever, and B, can we fire? Can we fire? B can take out a lot of people like that. Damn, I thought we could fire mid-reload, though. That's all right, though. Because real talk, I do have a really good strategy to use with uh, transport helicopters in most games. Because most of them have, like, the turrets in the side, usually what I like to do is find a comfy, cozy building to park it on, and then just use the turret from, like, a OP vantage point. So, like, if we could land on a building up over here, right, then we could just use the minigun to shoot everyone on the roof. It's, like, the perfect plan. Just have to land the helicopter oh so delicately. That didn't work out. Oh so delicately and it's pretty good. Looks pretty good. Yes, we I think we did it. I think we got it. Alright, it's not ideal. But look at that. Now we can just spawn camp with this thing and destroy everyone up there. Oh! Scratch that. We have two flags to spawn camp. And we can destroy the enemy AA. See, this is what I used to do in Battlefield. Like, I'd always get in the helicopters, park it somewhere awful. And then I'd have a minigun that looks straight into the enemy base. Such an overpowered strategy. Would recommend. And then, for example, say these are enemy helicopters. Well, guess what? Look at that. You have a turret right there. Take down three and a couple shots. It's really unfortunate. Those were all my teammates, but... You know, I'm just providing an example, right? <laughs> anyway, though, we could sit there all day until we won. Let's try and move in with our helicopter and actually capture a base here. We have the weapons for it. We have the health for it. We could do this. Just one guy in the way right now. You could be booped. Well, that didn't work. Hey. There we go. That did work. Can I just enter this and hide in the turret? Let's work out. Hi. I think this is working out. Yeah? Okay, so far so good. Are we cat? Oh. So far not good. What? Ha we're inside. Oh, wait. We're actually walking around in here. I think there's a seat that doesn't have, like, an assigned place, so... That's what keeps on happening. So there's a guy walking inside this. Now we're trapped. Hmm. I think I have an option for this, though. I'm gonna wait in a second to see if we can actually capture the base, because that's ideal here first. Oh, it disappeared. Hey, what's going on, man? Okay, gun. Are we gonna fire this? There we go. Okay, little strange. Didn't expect it to disappear on me, but here we are now. And it looks like we're actually gonna be able to capture the base here. Well, that works out fine then. Didn't even have to use my other plan. But now we have the base, I kind of want to try it out. Okay, so pretty much here, I have this rocket launcher. It's called the Pew Gun. And what it does is, 
well, I guess it's best to show you. Oh. Something along those lines, except imagine this helicopter and now... Yeah. Sends it flying a trillion miles away. And say if you hit a person, hey man. It just literally deletes them. It's really fun. So I'm thinking here, if we're trapped in this, or if we're just even inside. See, we're in this seat. Do we have our weapon? No. Can we get our weapon out? Oh, there we go. See, we're in this seat, and we use this. Will this send us forward into the enemy base? I think I missed the helicopter. Round two. Is this just not working? What if I... Okay, so now I just crawled inside here and we're, wa we're walking here. We're walking here! So now this should work, right? Oh. Oh. It, like, phased me out of the helicopter and then it exploded. Well, now we know. So let's go ahead now and flip the script. This time, I'll be defending. And I'll be defending from right here, because I think you guys know why. We have an ammo bag. We have the pew gun. Let's have some fun. Hello, and... Goodbye. Please go back to whence you came. Or perhaps to another timeline. Ooh, double! That was amazing! Own oh, little boats are even trying. How dare you? How dare you? <laughs> One man army here. One man army. And then the last helicopter. Oh, friend. I apologize. But goodbye! <laughs> trying to shoot at me still. <laughs> Oh, you little rascal, you trying to shoot me so I can't destroy you? How dare you? Oh, snap. They actually got some on the island here. I have failed! No! Reload anytime. Anytime. There we go. This thing's reload is awful, man. And this shotgun is not a super ranged weapon. RIP! I have failed. It's time, then, to switch up the gear. Alright, so round two here. Still gonna try and shoot down the helicopter. It's gonna be significantly more difficult with a weapon that's not horrifically overpowered. And we actually have to aim a bit and lead. Damn, that is insanely difficult. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna make that work. So, yeah, I'll try and shoot them down when I can. When I can't, I have a F2000 here. Insane O fire rate. But again, not the best at the distances. Okay, that was a huge waste of ammo. When I should be focusing on these guys. Woo! Okay. When I get a little closer, this thing's pretty good. This thing's pretty good. Slide, protect me. You're my hero. Oh, yeah. This thing's wild. And there are a lot of enemies. Good thing I still have this. Just a boop and a bop and a boop and a bop bop. There we go. And yeah, we defended it. Oh, almost. Where do these guys keep coming from? Wow, and this scar secondary is really good too. Oh no, Kibitz, why? Every game this happens. Sorry, alternate timeline, Kibitz. Oh wow, and we actually already won. Dang, you know, I didn't think we'd actually win considering uh wasn't using like the hyper overpowered stuff, but look at us now. Oh, here's the real strategy, though. Like, firing at the Blackhawks and trying to shoot inside them through the big open door. Oh, man. That's how we should have been doing it. However, we've already won, so it doesn't really matter. Anyway, though, I think that is going to be all for this video. So if you guys enjoyed, again, remember to leave a like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. And I hope to see you in the next one. So have a fantastic rest of your day. And bye bye <laughs>